Hi guys, this is Megan with the blog WilsonHomestead.com and today I am going to be doing a cloth diaper review video. I'm going to be reviewing the newborn all-in-one La Petite Hours cloth diaper. I know you guys really enjoyed when I did the Nora's Nursery review video, so I have this whole uh, review video series coming up. I'm going to review like five or six different cloth diaper brands and let you guys know which ones I like, what I think about them, how high quality they are so that you guys know what cloth diapers that you should buy. So this video is sponsored by Green Maternity. They sell, this is where I got all these cloth diapers. She was so kind to send them to me. But I also want you guys to know that I wouldn't review something that I didn't actually love to use for ourselves or that I thought was really high quality. So these are things that I would be reviewing anyway, even if this video wasn't sponsored. So these are all diapers that I'm going to give very honest opinions of and reviews and let you guys know exactly what I think of these. So let's get right into this video. So I have it open here on her website where she has the listing. So this newborn diaper is $12.99 on her website. This is size 7 to 15 pounds. So this was a little bit big on Vivian when she was a newborn because she was only 5 pounds 14 ounces. So she was a tiny, tiny little thing. But for my other kids, if I had had these diapers when they were newborns, they were 7 and 8 pounds when they were babies so this would have been absolutely perfect for them so for Vivian I would just take out the insert that's a little bit thicker and I would just take a little cloth wipe and I would fold it in half and lay it in there and that was enough absorption and it made it a little bit smaller so it fit on her easier so you can do that to try to fit it on a smaller baby but in general this works best on a 7 to 15 pound baby Vivian is 14 pounds now so this diaper still fits on her but it's getting on the verge of a little bit too small so pretty soon I'll have to retire it until we have our next baby. It has an opening in the back so these are pocket diapers and they can also be considered all-in-ones because they have snaps right here to snap on just a thing on the top. This also has some kind of thick, this also has a thick pad inside so this can be considered an all-in-one, it can be considered a pocket diaper because it has so many different features. So this inner line is made of one layer of microfiber and three layers of bamboo. So I'm not always the hugest fan of microfiber, but this is mostly bamboo layers, so that makes me really happy because I love bamboo. And then also, it's not directly on your baby's skin, so that layer is on the inside, and then there's the soft layer on the top that's going to protect your baby's skin from the microfiber, so that's really good. Each of these diapers comes with one of these boosters with the dry effect on one side, so this same material that's in the diaper is the drying effect, so this is a material that the moisture will just go through here, and this will stay dry on your baby so that they don't get rashes or start feeling uncomfortable with all the wetness. So this is one layer of microfiber and four layers of bamboo. So again, mostly bamboo. And then also th this is the part that goes in. So your baby's only gonna be making contact with this dry material. The diaper interior is made of gray suede. It's 100% polyester for a really great drying effect. This has a lot of great adjustments. So it has double snaps to adjust around their sides. It has a three rise setting snaps to adjust it smaller for, for a younger baby. So it has one, two, three, and then here you can snap it down to the second, to the third, and it makes it quite a bit smaller if you do that, or you can... I don't have it down adjusted at all because she's 14 pounds now, so I have it all the way out like this. And then also back to the side snaps, I really like it when diapers have a double, a double row like this. When they only have one row, it can be harder to get a really precise fitting. So when you have two like this, this, the top row is what adjusts around their waist and the bottom row is what helps adjust around their legs better. So if you have a baby with thinner legs and a fatter stomach, you can do here on the stomach and then you can go, and then you can go back one on the leg. So it doesn't have to be evenly up and down. You can make it really more customized when it has two rows like that. Another thing about the snaps that I've noticed is these feel like they're very high quality snaps. Sometimes on really cheaply made cloth diapers, you'll snap it in and it won't make that really good, like strong snapping noise. And you'll be able to tell that it just, it goes in there really loosely and it feels like it'll just like come out right away when you pull on it. So these snaps feel like 
even if I use these for a long, long time, the snaps are gonna stay really nice and strong. So there's just a single gusset around the legs. Normally I prefer having a double gusset. It just helps with more, helps more with leaking and around the leg is the most likely spot for a cloth diaper to leak. It is the spot that can be hardest to get a really snug fit. So I generally prefer double gussets around the legs, but if they're going to be single, they need to be really high quality. So if you stretch this out, it feels like really strong and high quality, like it's not going to wear out so fast. Some cloth diapers that are really cheaply made will have elastic that will feel like it's, it'll, if you stretch it out, it like it'll stay stretched for too long, even when you let it go after just a few washings and having your baby wear it, like they'll wear out really fast. But this has been washed a whole bunch of times and worn a whole ton and stretched like this a lot and it still feels really high quality and good. So if you're not gonna have double gussets, the elastic at least needs to be really high quality like this. It has elastic around the back in this pocket that also feels really good. It doesn't have any opening in the front or any elastic, which I do actually prefer that it doesn't. So I like that when the front of the diaper is just closed and there's only one opening, then your inserts can't fall out the front or anything. So if when you're going to put this on your baby, generally when I'm putting this on Vivian, I will just take this, this insert here has snaps that go right onto this, these snap right in, and then this just lays on the top like this, and then you put it around your baby like that. You can, because this is a pocket, you can stuff it inside of here, and that works just fine too. I find that if a diaper has snaps for you to put it on, I will just do that because it's much faster and easier than stuffing your whole hand in there, but it does have that option. And then also, like I said, when she was tiny, I would take a wipe and fold it in half. And then that, because it doesn't have snaps to hold it secure, I would stuff that inside. But again, this does have a layer of absorption. So you don't even need to add that extra layer. If your baby doesn't pee a lot, I tend, tend, newborns tend to not pee huge amounts as as much as they will now that she's six months old so you could totally get away with that for a while and then add this in later this item is also cpsia certified it has no bpa phytholates i don't know if i'm pronouncing that right or lead so this diaper is completely non-toxic this is going to save you a lot of money on disposable diapers it's really high quality so this is going to last me through several babies I have been cloth diapering long enough that I can just kind of tell if a diaper's only gonna last through one kid or several kids. And this one seems like it's high quality enough that it's gonna last for a while, which I really like, especially since it will fit on a newborn. I don't have as many newborn cloth diapers, so I was really excited to get these. So, moral of the story, these are some of my new favorite diapers. Out of all the brands that I've tried, this is probably my second favorite. It's like up in the top three. So that's really saying something. So I highly recommend this brand. Make sure you go check out the description box because I will link this exact diaper for you guys. And I'll also link where you can get extra of the inserts if you need more inserts. So make sure you go check out Green Maternity's website and thank you for watching this video. I will see you in the next one. Bye.